Welcome back. I hope you are doing well. Today I have got 30 jailbreak tweaks and I will go through them quickly. Now let's go to the first one. If you take a look on the left status bar on the top, you can see the internet speed right here. So the tweaks, it will add the internet speed to your status bar. And whenever you use the internet, for example, if I go to Safari and I surf the web, and you can see the internet speed on the top here, so you can easily um, see your internet speed. Blanca will add live style to dock notification center and also widgets. And you can see on the dock, you can see we have live style and on widgets as well. And it does work on notification center too. This tweak let you disable or enable dark mode by swipe down on settings app. And as you can see, when I swipe down, it will enable dark mode. Or when I swipe down again, it will disable dark mode. So it is a quick way to access dark mode. Shuffle will organize settings app. And as you can see, when I swipe all the way down, there is no tweaks. So to go to tweaks, you can find here. So there are three sections. So we have tweaks, app, and system app. So if you go to system app, and all the system app are here, and go to apps, the third party app is right here. Turkeys will add dark mode to Sidea. So usually with Sidea, you don't have dark mode. So you can install Turkey. And now we have um, dark mode fully inside here. So here is the home page and search. Now move on to the next one. So the tweaks, it will um, enable or disable dark mode depend on the brightness. If I decrease the brightness all the way down, you can see dark mode is automatically enable. Or when I increase um, brightness all the way to the top, you can see um, dark mode is disabled. Beta CC11 is pretty awesome. It will um, organize control center. And as you can see on the top, we can access to Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, or airplane mode. And you can enable all of those options from here. And in the middle, we have music player. So you can play music from here as well. And if you want to have the clean lock on control center, you can install Cool CC. And as you can see on my um, control center, we have the clean lock right here. So we only see the border of um, each module. Move on to Cast Tool. It will give you the animation when you scroll on your phone. And as you can see, when I scroll, there is the color on the cell. And you can change the um, style as well. So if you go to style, and now I'm going to go to flip. And now when I scroll, and you can see we have um, another style. Now move on to Lock Void 2. It will add the void faces to your iPhone lock screen. And you can see on my iPhone lock screen, we have the new void face where I can force touch just like the Apple Void. And I can swipe across them. And you can also add the new one as well if you are running on iOS 13.5. And you will have the new rainbow void faces as well. And as you can see right here where I can add, it is pretty awesome. Now move on to Xeon. So Xeon just like Zeppelin, it just um, gonna add the logo to your carrier. So if I go to control center, you can take a look on the left here. We have the logo right here. And you can install Xeon and then we can change the theme as well. And there are a ton of them. You can select um, the favorite one and you can see here. Switch confirm, it will ask before you go into the other app. So for example, I go to Safari right here. When I click on the link, and it will ask me first, as you can see whether you want to go or not. And if you want to go to um, the App Store, you can click on Allow. And then it will pop up into the App Store, as you can see here. And you can select for specific app in settings right here, where you can select the app. Now move on to the next one. This tweaks, it will show the upcoming alarm. If you go to your notification center on the top, and now there is no alarm, that's why it's so um, no upcoming alarm. And if you go to clock, and then you add new alarm right here. So I'm gonna add a new one and then click on sale. And now when I go to my notification center again, you can see we have the upcoming alarm right here on the top. Better widgets allow you to customize almost everything on widgets where you can just um, have the square widget right here, or you can set the widget to transparent, and we can hide some element from widgets as well. It is pretty awesome. Or you can set the blur background for widgets. Folder list, it will add the list of the app inside the folder. So if I go to folder, and as you can see, all of the app are listed here. 
Orion will bring pick and pop back to device that have the 3D touch hardware. So just like um, before, we can just um, force touch and then you can see here, we can just force touch. You can see the animation is much faster. You move on to the next one. If you want to clear the icon back much faster, you can install the tweak where you can just force touch and then go to um, clear bed. So if you click on clear bed, you don't see um, the icon bed anymore. We look, reload it, it will turn the icon into the widgets. So for example, I can force touch on the clock right here and then you can select on reload. So I'm gonna go to medium size. It also support on weather as well, where I can just force touch again and then go to reload right here. I'm gonna allow it and then we can click on medium size and as you can see it is pretty awesome if you want a new style on battery icon you can install half and as you can see here we have the new style on battery icon after you install the tweaks you can add up to five icon on dock so i'm gonna show you right now so i'm gonna move this um, app into the dock and then we're gonna have a five icon on dock as you can see here Doors Mix allow you to change the door style and shape and also the color on dots as well. So you can enable here the one that you like and I can enable my custom color as well here. So and then we can just um, drag and change the color and then you can just respring. Now take a closer look on dots, you can see we have the new color and the new shape right here. For now, if you own iOS 13.5, you can install Grass. This app is very useful. It is going to show you which tweaks isn't working well on your device. iPad device will bring iPad feature to your iOS devices. If you go to Safari and watch a video, and then you can have the new feature here where you can go to picture in picture mode so you can click on this one and then you go, you can go back to home screen and the video is still playing as you can see right here invisible shortcuts it will hide flashlight and camera icon from the lock screen but it still preserve the function and you can see here at the bottom we don't have we don't see the flashlight and camera button but you can just force touch just like usual and then you can go to camera or you can force touch on here to enable flashlight download bar it will add the bar and also percentage while you are download the app from the app store and you can see here if you want to see which tweaks is compatible with ios 13.5 you can install tweak compatible where you can see uh, which tweaks is compatible with ios 13.5 and there is a list right here where you can um, install your favorite one compatible mac is similar to tweak compatible as well so for the tweak it will add the check mark into side here so you can see which tweaks is compatible with your version and as an example you can see adaptive dark mode right here we have the green check mark so it is compatible with my version real cc allow you to disable and enable wi-fi and bluetooth without um, having to go to settings and turn it off again so it will just turn off straight away from control center so if i disable bluetooth right here and now you can see in settings bluetooth also disable we have dark phone 12 it will completely transform phone app into dark mode and as you can see here we have um, dark mode completely in phone apps and i can go to contest it also in dark mode as well or i can go to favorite it also in dark mode move on to the last one we have photo info where you can see the resolution and the size of the photo or video from the photo apps and as you can see here we have the resolution and the size on the top finally thanks for watching i hope you like all of these tweaks and for this video it is much um, quickly so i don't show all the feature of the tweaks so i just um, make it possible for all the tweaks together that's why the video is much faster and thanks for watching and if you want to get this theme 
I also include my description as well. 